Haitian runner Astral Clovis sees Port-au-Prince changing three years after the country's devastating earthquake. He says the homes used to be close together, but with reconstruction, there's now more space. If there is another earthquake, he doesn't think they'll lose a lot of people like before. 316,000 people died in the 2010 earthquake, which destroyed more than 100,000 homes. Today, there are still few sidewalks, let alone bike lanes, so it's hard not to notice Clovis running through traffic. He passes a pub selling $8 pints of Guinness and rubble where hotels used to be. More than $5 billion in foreign aid has been spent, and Clovis, like many Haitians, thought reconstruction would be further along by now. Still running long distances has helped the 42-year-old mechanic claim a measure of hope. His wins of 5 and 10K races bring in a small sum of money, so he's well off compared to his neighbors, 70% of whom live on less than $2 a day. Potholes and smog will not stop him. After running a two-hour and 42-minute marathon in neighboring Dominican Republic, Clovis hopes for a marathon in Haiti so he can win at home. Naya Hawkins, Associated Press.